Gentlemen, welcome to Witch Cancer State World Play. Mickey Sticky Flowers here. I'm here in my K5 uh, Blazer, right, my Chevrolet. Uh, yeah, I found this thing. I'm, I marked it stolen many, many, many years ago. I think the registration's about to be expired though. Or it probably is expired, I don't know. But yeah, I found it. Apparently it wasn't stolen. And I don't know, uh, I don't know. Uh, the cops know, uh, but uh, I don't know. Uh, I found it though, so yeah, I got I, I got my I got my K5 back, ladies and gentlemen. So let's go driving around in it, man. It's been a while. I probably need to get some gas too. Put my seatbelt on. And let's go drive around. Let's go get some gas. Let's go this way. No, oh, this thing rides smooth still. Oh, Jesus. Whoops. <laughs> Hopefully my light still works. Let's find out. Oh, we're good. Yeah, this thing. This thing is... Salad, bro. This thing's salad, bro. Just driving around cruising. Go to the gas station. Get some gas, man. It's windy roads, though. Eddie. There's the gas station over there. This is a nice house over here. Oh, yeah. It's literally Drazzo's house, but in a different location. I never met the guy, but apparently he's a well-known name around in this state. And this car is pissing me off, man. Yeah, it's time to be waiting for them, man. They're going slow. This thing still got the pickup power. We'll find out when we get on the highway there over we'll here, man. Cause I'm gonna rip it. It's been a long time since I drove this thing. I could have swore back in like 80, 88 or 89 that the cops impounded this thing. Uh, there's an accident waiting to happen, and it did happen. The worst intersection here in the state. Come on, shift. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Picking at speed. Picking at speed. Thanks, still got power, man. Let's get some gas, man. I think it's on the side, yeah, it's right there. Oh, wait, no. Why did I pick up a cherry can? 
Here we go. A few moments later. Haven't seen this in a while. This looks cool. Oh yeah, man. It's been a while since I've been to Wisconsin, man. Hopefully I'm getting the warrants up from my race right here. I'd be fucked up if I do. Cause I've been gone for a long time. I mean, I guess the only thing they can get me on is allegedly I was supposed to show it to a court date. I don't remember if I hit one, to be honest with you. It's been a while. We're gonna find out, though. Eventually. I mean, I know they're probably gonna pull me over because they're gonna think this is stolen. I thought I called them, or maybe I couldn't, I don't know, but I found it. I mean, I reported it stolen, like, years ago. Like, maybe, like, 10, 15 years ago, man. And then I forgot that it was at a garage. And I forgot that I own the garage. Well, I don't own the garage. I know someone that owns the garage who let me keep it there. And he was like, yeah, man, he was like, I saw that you reported the car stolen the other day. Like, uh, on the, I don't know. I saw it on the news, it was like a few years ago that this got like released out to the news or whatnot. I was like, yeah man, like, I kind of uh, called my uh, my K5 being stolen. And he basically said, nah man, it's in my garage. So, I mean, I don't like talking to the pigs anyway, so I, probably, I, I don't think I called them, I may have, I don't know. Fucking pigs. Oh shit. Oh shit, there's a guy behind me, fuck. Turn up my engine, man. Oh shit. Oh fuck. What did he get me for? I mean, maybe it's a vehicle, I don't know. And again, I'm a little, I mean, I did some drugs earlier, so I'm a little fucked up, but not really fucked up. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. What is he doing, man? Driver. Take the keys out of the ignition and throw them out the window now. Whoa, whoa, what's going on? Throw the keys out the window. Whoa. With your left hand, open the driver's side door from the outside and step out slowly. Take two steps to your left, and then walk backwards to the sound of my voice. Whoa, okay, okay, okay. Keep walking. All right. What's going on, man? I'm scared. All right, stop. Go ahead, watch the vehicle. Put that gun down. Don't point it at me, man. What's going on? Watch your head for me. Yeah, all right, I'm watching my head. The vehicle's clear. Okay. Well, you're up. You should be good to break off, help with that officer down. Temple. Yeah. Sir, what's gonna be your name? My name's Mickey Flowers, M-I-C-K-Y. Mickey Flowers. What's going on with this vehicle you have here? That's my vehicle. Mm -hmm. Uh, do you have an ID on you or anything? I mean, yeah, one second. 
Alright, one second. Alright. Uh, where's that ID gonna be located for me? It's in my back pocket. Make you flowers. Alright. Mr. Flowers, do you own this vehicle with anyone else? Uh, is, he, no, it, is it like shared or you let anyone else drive it? It's my vehicle. Like probably about like 15 years ago, I reported it stolen and coincidence, I found it today. It was in a buddy's garage. It was in your buddy's garage? Yeah, he, he called me up and he was like, hey, I just saw like an old commercial with your like your K5 being stolen. He was like, Did, didn't you remember that you put it in my garage, man? And I'm like, oh, I put it in your garage, bro? He was like, yeah, man. I went over there, we'll let, you, we'll let you know. It's right there. So the thing about marking a vehicle as stolen with the DMV, when you call them again and have put uh, stolen with the DMV, it stays marked as stolen oh, until sh someone unmarks it. Oh, so I did it like years ago. I forgot. Yeah. So, because of that, we just, uh, left it stolen, sir. Oh, shit. My bad. Alright, I'm just gonna check a couple of things real quick. Alright. Fuck. My buddy told me I should have called fuck. Maybe I should have called fuck. It's my. Uh, always getting hassled. Turned up with charges. Bullshit. Uh. <laughs> I mean, I technically knew I marked it as stolen, but I wanted to play it off. Like, years ago, I called this car stolen, you know? I mean, as long as I got nothing wrong with me in the DMV. Alright, well, Mr. Flowers, I apologize for the confusion. We still have a vehicle marked as stolen in our system. That's the whole reason I stopped you. I, go, I already made a report to the judge asking for it to be marked as unstolen. So you should be good. But you are going to need to revalidate the registration because it's been 20 years. That stuff expires in like two years. Oh, alright. Yeah, I can go tomorrow and do that. Yeah, that's that's completely fine. I know you just got it today, so I'm not gonna hassle you for that. Uh, here's your ID, but uh, thank you. And you should be good to go. Just take care, drive safe. All right, I appreciate it. Have a good one, sir. Right, have a good one, pig. I was like, have a good one, pig. <laughs> Fucking pig. Fuck you. Fucking asshole. I don't care that she's a fucking female, too. I used to like the female cops, to be honest with you. I always, I always used to want to get their number. Dicky always tried to be honest with you. I don't even give a fuck anymore. Fucking male, female, doesn't matter which you are. You're a fucking pig, and you're a fucking... Fuck you. That's all I gotta say. Fucking assholes. I mean, I knew that. I, I, I mean, I called it years ago. It should have. It should have been like you, you thought that they probably would have just took it off the list. Like it's been years. That thing's gone. <laughs> Fucking pigs. There you go, find some drugs, man. Oh, shit. There's a burger shot in town. I have to go get a burger later. I want some drugs though. Fuck. Oh, 
shit. Oh, fuck yeah, man. That door is glitched. Whatever. It's locked. They can't physically get in there. If you know what I mean. They physically cannot get in there. I know some guy in here that I met back in the day that sells drugs. Hey, what's going on? Yo, is Johnny back here? Yeah, alright. Yo, where are at? What's going on, man? It's been years. No, I can't, I can't do that call as good as I did once in a day. Load, man. <laughs> yeah, man. So, like, uh... Do you got any drugs in you? Oh, yeah? You got one out to read? And what? You got a you got a what? A few bags of, of uh, you got a few bags of what? Oh, you're you're looking for it. I own a few bags of coke. Oh shit, I'll take that. Yeah, yeah, there, there's the money, man. Hey, thanks, Ashley. You guys still doing that special where I could buy like a like a twelve pack or something behind like a? Oh yeah, you are. All right, yeah. Um. Yeah, I'll take this back. All right, later. Put this in the car. Let's get in. And I'm gonna drink a beer real quick. You know, get a little drunk for it, get on the road. If you drive sober, you're gonna get pulled over, so you gotta be a little drunk. They ain't gonna tell the difference. There's no way they're gonna tell the difference. Cause I'm not gonna be that drunk. Alright, let's chug the rest of this. Yeah. There we go. See, I, I don't feel that drunk. I like my car. We're good. Just one beer. Out of that six pack, so there's only five left. Let me see the one. If I hear this dinging, man. Right, let's go. Go to Yale Jack and get more drunk, man. Oh shit, what's going on over here? Oh nice. A little shop going on. Some guys opened up. Oh, 
fuck? Is this road closed? Can't be closed. Dirt. Makes no sense. Let's go get more drunk, man. How many bags of these coke do I have? Oh, I got six bags of coke. I have to take like four bags in, you know. Get out of the truck, man. Stupid. Was that a fucking cap, bro? Yeah, what's up, Sandra? Yeah. Nah, I'd like drinking beer here. Fuck that. Fuck Ashley. I mean, it's a good bar and all, but you got the cheaper beer. Her place is a little bit more newer and fancier. A few moments later. And I did some of that, the, the stuff I shared with you to get this stuff for a discount. <laughs> yeah, the, the drugs. <laughs> Alright, later, Sandra. Oh, shit. Fuck. Alright, I should be good. I should be good, Mickey. Just get one hand on the wheel. You'll be alright. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, see, I unlocked it just fine. Let's put the seatbelt on. Get it, keep it, keep it straight, man. Keep it straight. Oh fuck! Hopefully that's not count. Keep it straight, man. Keep it straight. Fuck. Keep it straight. Get the focus, make you focus. Sir, are you all right? Uh, yeah, uh, I'm all right, man. What's going on? Have you had anything to drink today? A little. See, it's not completely my fault. You guys came out of nowhere. So what's 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 going on? Why why one did you not stop when you're coming into into an intersection? And two, no why are you driving there. if you drank? There's no stop. You are still 
you are turning, you have to yield the right away to oncoming traffic. Yeah, fuck that, uh, fuck that suggestion. Okay, how much have you had to drink today? About a 12 pack. About a 12 pack? Yeah. Okay, and how long ago was that? I just left the yellow jack. Okay. Hey, Johnson, you want to do a PBT? Yeah. What was that? What all right, sir, so this this officer over here is going to administer a portable breathalyzer test. Do you consent to submit it to a portable breathalyzer test? I mean, I don't, but I'm going to fucking get it taken anyway, so sure. Well, you have the right to refuse. You guys are just going to make me take it anyways. Sir, you have the right to refuse if you don't want to do the portable breathalyzer test. Nah, I refuse then. Fuck it. Okay. Go ahead, turn around then. Wait, no, you're not putting me in cuffs. No, uh, don't move. Fuck. Stop. At this point in time, you're going to be placed under arrest for driving under the influence. Okay. At this point in time, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say, we can Sir, I'm going to ask you one more time. Because he's, denial is. He's denied. He already denied four times. Okay. You're going to be placed under arrest at this time for DUI. All right, driving under the influence. So at this point in time, you have the right to remain silent. Anything you say or do, Ken and will be against you Bullshit. for law. You have the right to attorney. If not for attorney, one will be pointed to you. All right. Yeah, right, stop answering questions at any point in time. All right. All right. Fucking do you good. have a cage or no? I have a cage. Yeah. You do? Yeah, Better not I put me in a fucking put it cage. On, apparently. I'm not I'll a fucking animal. I'll just put him in this Tahoe over here. I'm not an animal. You better not put me in a fucking cage. Oh, okay. Oh, done. You have anything on you that's gonna poke me, stick me, stab me, or prick me? Any guns, knives, bombs, or explosives? Bombs? I can't have a bomb on me. No, I don't get none of that, man. If you could also pay attention to uh, Skybox for my partner over here. Yeah, man. Yeah, I'm chilling. That did never happened in my head. Gotcha. All right. Well, he's in the back of your car, Johnson. Oh. Fuck. Okay. Let's Jesus. Go <laughs> yeah, go ahead. Just pull off to the right. You're good. You can go through. Hey. I think I got neck whiplash. <laughs> Sit there for me, look. Alright, you fucking big. Get out of my foot. Fuck. The door doesn't close, you idiot. Idiot. Good. Okay, sir. Yeah, what's going on? Got a uh, little card I need to read to you. Um, He's been Miranda. Might have already been read, but I'm, I'm going to read it one more time. Okay. If I can find it. Are you good with the blazer for it to get towed? You better not tell yeah, my fucking blazer. The, uh, just, just no, don't tell it. Or... No, don't. Search it. Alright. Uh, this is your Miranda warning. Before we ask you any questions, you must understand your rights. You have the right to remain silent. If you say it can, will be against you in court. You have the right to talk to a lawyer for advice before we ask you any questions. You have the right to talk to a lawyer during question. If you can have four lawyer, you want to be appointed to do if you will. If you decide to answer any questions without a lawyer present, you still have the right to stop at any time. You also have the right to stop answering at any time until you talk to a lawyer. Do you understand your rights? I understand my rights. Right, so, whether you like it or not, you were involved in an accident where yeah the fucking pig hit me so hold on so where you were involved in an accident we have to do a, a blood alcohol test whether you like it or not so even uh, though you refuse it we're, we're gonna just do one at the hospital fuck I'm riding with you no oh, that was what I say who just got in me we're going to the hospital first that's fine you said you're gonna let me free? No. 
This is bullshit. Do what? Is what? What's Megan's call sign? Uh, seven o three. It's seven o three. Yes, sir. Get your hands up. Man. I need this uh, guy's blood alcohol test done. A few moments later. What did you find in the blazer? Nothing in the blazer. Are you he sure? He just had it. Uh, he said he had a 12 oh. pack and he just got back from the yellow jack. But oh, you didn't find no my response. bag of weed in there and coke? Uh, that's good. We didn't get a response, so. Yeah, yeah, you did. I'm looking at it. Okay. He has a point one. Eventually. Gonzo. Yo. Is it your arrest? Yes. Okay. You said you're setting me free? No. You're hard of hearing. <laughs> no, I'm not hard of hearing. I just wanna I just wanna get set free. Right. Fuck the police. Yeah, that, that's correct. Alrighty boss, what's your name? Search you that there wasn't any ID. It was just flowers. My name's Mickey Flowers. Mickey Flowers. Uh, M I C K Y. Flowers Flowers no, you're good. Thank you. Right. See ya. And my brother Dicky Cheese is probably out there doing drugs and driving around drunk as well. But you'll never find him. So much later that the old narrator got tired of waiting and they had to hire a new one. Alrighty, ladies and gentlemen, do you have it, Mickey Sticky Flowers, back in jail? Here in Wisconsin. Apparently, I was supposed to yield at that turn, and apparently, I, I got caught being drunk, got sent to jail for being drunk, even though they didn't breathalyze me until I got to the hospital, forced me to take it, even though they gave me a choice, I said no, but then I got forced to fucking take it anyway, it's fucking bullshit, but, yeah, allegedly, I was supposed to yield at that turn to stop, and there's no stop sign, and there's no yield sign, so it's fucking stupid, and... Cop fucking hit me and fucking, yeah, fucking bullshit. But yeah, other than that, ladies and gentlemen, my drugs allegedly did not get found, but they were supposed to be found, but allegedly they didn't do their jobs. But other than that, I don't know if I'm still gonna have them, but I, I don't know if I'm gonna get charged with that. I didn't really get read all my charges, to be honest with you, so I don't really know what I got until I go to court. But until next time, ladies and gentlemen. Fucking bullshit fucking cabs out here in Wisconsin. Trump me up with charge and hassling me, man. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and I will see you all next time. Hey! Listen!